Hello, and today I am going to bring you the greatest Scout, Scout Transformer in the world. It is Dev Charge. So listen to the music and enjoy if it continues. Okay, now, Dip Charge is actually a really awesome looking transformer. By the way, this song is Cyber Killer. No copyright it because my brother is playing it. It's um awesome looking scalp though, and it's got really nice detail throughout the oh. <laughs> the, old, the only problem is um the gaps. I'm late. But yeah. Even that's painted. So yeah. What did boats do? Absolutely nothing. Let's transform this guy. Transformation. Um oh, you wanna pretty much grab the entire boat and flip it. Rotate the waist, spread the legs. Fold down these parts of the boat. Kind of do something. So he's not looking all weird. And so he's got kind of like bunker logs. You bunk it. Bunk it down. And you kind of just bring these up, spread the top. Take form. Pop off shoulder pad. So, once of all, I know. I just need to pop that on. Oh, I'll tell you my ears, and I'm not dead singing. Okay. Now, here is Depth Charge in Robot Mode. And it's Robot Mode. Wow, he just looks like the boss, the badass of the group. He, lo he, he looks like he should be like the Omega Supreme of everything. He just looks so big and in real life, he'd be bigger than this guy. By massives and be stronger. Whoa, I don't know how. Let's look at this back so I quickly fix that. And then I will show you a comparison again. Yes. Shows how much I care about my toys. Boom. Size comparison compared to Revenge of Fallen Leader Optimus Prime. Um, yeah. How about I, um, another thing around its size genre? How about if I can reach this again? Thank God, Master. How about Autobot Gussel, who I'll be reviewing in next? Definitely bigger. The only reason why I'm reviewing these two because they they look like the bulky ones. The Autobots. Okay. Articulation now. Brought on at the shoulder, so you can go up and down. The shoulder pad doesn't affect it since it's on a hinge. Swivel, double elbow. And a thumb. And he's also got a um thumb as it's degrees on the head and a tinsy tiny bit of up and down. Three hundred and sixty degrees on the waist. Ball drawn up there. Swiffle and a great knee joint. Also he's got um in and out here. Um up and um, back and forth there. So yeah, highly articulated, great for posing, just a overall cool 
fit gear. I mean like that, he just looks awesome. So this is Firestorm Lad 123 signing off.